Hello everyone, Neophys here, and welcome back to Season 2 of Neophys Playing Minecraft. And this is episode number 2. And in our last episode, we bypassed that village after taking some food from it and killing all the livestock we could find around it. And we got some coal and a little bit of iron, and we're trucking along here now uh, to find... A decent base. It'd be nice if I found some extreme hills. Oh look, kitty cat. <laughs> nice if I found some extreme hills. I've got lots of food here, so I'm not going to kill any more livestock or waste any more time killing livestock mm. along here. Um, but I am going to motor along mm. and see what else I can find. It'd be nice if I found a, a, a kind of nice spot to set up a, a, like a, a base. Is that high hills over there? It looks like it. Hmm, that might be a good spot. Oh, here's a cave. I almost walked right into it, eh? Ooh, that goes deep, 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 deep. Oh, I need to remember this spot. So let's just put a torch here, so hopefully I'll see it from a distance. And we'll uh, come back that way when we want to explore a deep cave. Ooh, jeez. Ooh, jeez, I'm hearing mobs. They must be just... What, is this a cave that they're down inside of? Oh jeez, yeah. Oh, oh, and there's some iron. Ah, oh, do I dare risk it? Are the mobs... Oh yes, there's a... Zombert. Okay, Zombert. Let's see if we can just get rid of you and get the iron. Yes. Oh, there's lots of iron here. Okay, let's get the iron. Oh, there's another Zombert. Where is he? Hopefully he's not too close. Maybe he's down there and he can't get up. I don't see him. Oh, what? He's maybe behind this hole? Oh, jeez, this looks like... Ex oh, there he is, too! <laughs> okay, we'll leave you behind. And we're going to go back up to the surface. We've got iron. Good. We've got some iron to get ourselves started off with here. And we're going to keep motoring along this way. So I put a torch down right over there. That's it. I should have made a pillar. Yeah, that's what I should do. I'm going to take this sand of mine and make a pillar there. Or actually, let's just make it right here on this high spot. And we'll put a torch there. So hopefully we'll be able to find this spot in the near future. There looks like some high hills off in the distance there. Mm. Oh, and there's a cowie here. Oh, jeez. Oh, there's more more coal, but I'm not going to stop for it. I want to uh, see if I can find some place to make a temporary... Oh, and the sun's going down. A temporary base. Mm. Yay. Oh, what? Am I back at the same village again? Did I really circle around? No, 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 I couldn't have. Look. That's got a blacksmith shop there. I could tell by the stone top. So that's a different village. And the sun's going down, so we better get our bed, lay it down. Have a nappy poo. Jeez. Oh no, I'm having trouble getting the bed laid down because of all the grass. Okay. Whew. Okay, it's daytime, and there's the village, so let's go check it out. This is looking favorable. Let's hopefully this one's a little bit uh, better. It's looking flatter, at least. And I'm not seeing a big cave under it, but uh, let's look a little more. Oh, water spilled out of the garden, okay. We've got a few gardens to choose from. This isn't bad. I'm not going to complain about this one. Ooh, it's like a cave over there. Yeah, and more livestock here, there, and everywhere. That's good. Lots of villagers ran running around, like the silly people that they are. And let's go check out the blacksmith shop here. I want to see what's in the chest. 
Ooh, score! Just what I need. Oh, I don't need the leggings, but I'll take it. I'll take the boots, I'll take the pieces of iron, the iron swords, an apple. Yay! Should I take the chest too? Yeah, let's take the chest too. We're gonna take the chest too. Hopefully they won't be angry that I took their chest. And let's see, is there a large building in this village? Because usually I like to commandeer the large building for myself to get started at least. Dun, 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 dun. I don't see any large buildings. Darn. I'm gonna be stuck with a little building. Or I'll have to build a building. That's it. That's what I'm gonna do. I'm not gonna take the, the, the little buildings in there. But that's good. This isn't bad. Uh, I think I'm happy about that. Um, it's not too large. I should be able to fence it in pretty easily. And um, secure it. It won't take too much to light it up. If I, if I just basically go around the roads and the gardens there, I should be able to fence it in pretty easily. It's not going to take a lot of work to level it or anything either. Because it's already pretty level. It's not bad, not bad at all. This is uh this will be one of the easier villages to secure that that I've seen for a long time. Lucky, lucky, lucky. All right. Ooh. Oh, these gar this garden goes back a fair distance though, so that's going to make the fence have to go a lot further than I was planning on. But no worries. It will be done. Yay. So, I guess this episode you get to see me uh, modify and secure a village. Now, normally I'll see those... Uh-oh. Let's put that chest down. Wait a second. Let's put on the boots. That's it. We'll put on the iron legs, too. Keep the those other legs off to the side. We'll put this chest down and put away things we aren't going to need for now. Um, I'm going to need a crafting bench for sure, though. Um, I'm going to have to be chopping more wood soon, too. But, uh, actually, maybe we should... Oh, wow, we got 63 coal. I didn't realize we had chopped so much coal out of the ground. Okay, well, let's uh cook up this iron here, because we'll have 16 after after we cook that. That's good. That's very good. Or, and uh, we haven't got a home yet, so we're going to just lay the bed right here for now, so that if I have to rush to bed, I can. Oh, we've got some dirt in case we need it to. Or actually, I need to have the gravel there for now. Oh, those villagers. Here, let me turn the volume down. They're starting to drive me batty already. Yeah, I said I wouldn't want to have villagers uh, this time around, but, you know, the village is a really good source of resources, and as long as I don't have to live right in it here with them making their ha <laughs> ha sound all the time, then I'm going to be good. And the, the, the immediate plan is to uh, set up a house outside of the village, but I want to quickly... Uh, try and do what I can to secure this. Usually the first thing I do is level off the walkways. To, uh, because I'm just not into them bouncing up and down and all around. Like I said, this is, this looks really good. This is mostly level already. Oh, if I had a bucket, I'd scoop up that water. That's what I should probably do, though. Because I've got the extra iron here. Let's make a bucket. We're gonna... Oh, I didn't lay my crafting bench down, did I? Okay, let's lay down the crafting bench here. We're gonna need a bucket eventually, so we might as well make it now and scoop up this water if we can. There's no water here to scoop up. Jeez. No water source block. Darn. Okay, well I thought there would be. <laughs> That's weird. That's a weird glitch in the game. 
And I'm not going to say Jeb fits your game. Tim, just not good. <laughs> oh, this is a weird road taken off that way. I don't know if I'm going to make use of that road there. Uh, what I think I'm going to do is we're going to level off the gravel here and then take it to the higher height beyond that point. Or maybe we should take it to the higher height right here. No, 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 no. I want as much of the village at the same level as possible here. Oh, I ended up with some... Okay, well, it's a good thing I don't really want this uh, walkway out here because I'm going to need the extra gravel. Okay, we got that. Let's just fill this back in quickly. There. And over here, we're going to fill this in. And then right here is where we're going to raise it. Okay. Usually I like to put stairs in at these spots too, but right at the moment I'm not going to concern myself with that. What I'm most concerned about at the moment is just trying to, like I say, level off the village, get things looking more neat and tidy, and then uh, then I'll have uh, everything the way I want it. Um, hmm. Yeah, a lot of the time I like having the gardens right at ground level. But because of the way this is laid out, this time I'm going to do it this way. Okay, see, that one's at ground level, and I like that. That's nice. And I'm probably going to do this. Ooh. Except, uh... There, that's okay. That'll work, that'll work. Over here, I need to level this down a bit, though. The shovel ain't going to last much longer, though. I'm going to have to make another shovel. I'm going to have to get more cobble soon, too, to make more tools. Mm. Yeah, there we go. Okay. Um, there's the crafting bench right here. Okay. Good. I do have lots more cobble. Okay. Let's get a couple more shovels going. Oh, I don't have enough sticks. Darn. Okay, well, let's get more sticks happening here. Make a couple more shovels. I might as well get this iron sword into place here. And put away uh, the stone swords. Let's put away one iron and one stone. I'll save this stone sword for killing livestock. That's it. <laughs> Uh, I'll hold on to the bucket. I am going to need the axe. I guess I don't really need these carrots kicking around because I have beef. Okay. On, on with continuing to modify the village here. Yeah, I kind of play this by ear when I do this. Like, you know, I'll, I'll take out some, I'll, t I'll step back and look at it a little, and then uh, I'll uh, make a few more changes, and eventually I'll be happy with it. I'm usually taking down all the tall grass, too, because it just gets in the way more than anything. If anything, it causes visual obstruction, so that you can't uh, see mobs at the distance or something. What, it's becoming night again already? Wow. Time flies when you're having fun in Minecraft, eh? Wow. Well, we'll give it another very brief time. And yeah, it looks like it's getting dark enough. They're all heading in, so I better head to bed. There we go. Okay, we're a little bit more than halfway through this episode. Um, let's, uh, I need, 
Wood. <laughs> I need wood, and I need, um, uh, cobblestone. Is what I really do need. Wood and cobblestone. Um, but I, yeah, I don't know. I'm tossed between what I should do and set the priority and so on here, you know? Let's level this off a bit. Oh, this is going to take a bit to level down. This is a bit of a hill here. I don't need to take it back too far, but let's take this top off. And... Yes, I don't want them jumping down into the garden by accident and trampling it. Oh, as I take this down, I'm going to get some cobble. Okay, good. Not enough, but some. Get that a little bit. And I will dig into that as well because uh, I'm going to replace it with earth. Soil, that is. Yes, I say soil, not dirt, because soil, things can grow in soil, but they can't grow in dirt. Dirt's the stuff that you get on you. Soil is the stuff under your feet that grows things. So, that's why I try to be careful and say the right thing. <laughs> oh, the shovel's almost gone. There it goes. At least I know that it's gone for good when it goes. Like, when I'm on a server and the shovel goes, it's not always gone. And that's the, the drag about being on a server. So, that's the one really nice thing about doing the single player, is the blocks break when you break them, <laughs> and they don't come back, which uh, gets really frustrating on a server when the, you break the blocks and they come right back. Okay, so, yeah, I might level this down even more. Yeah, that's what I'm going to be doing. I'm going to be taking this all the way down to the level of the village here. And that uh, spot there will keep that one level higher. And I guess I never really mentioned, yeah, I'm playing vanilla Minecraft. This is not a modded Minecraft at all. I like to play the vanilla. I've been playing the vanilla for quite some time now, and I'm not the least bit bored of it. I suppose eventually I'll get bored with the vanilla, and then I'll... Uh, maybe mod it to make it a little more exciting or something, but for now it's just fine. Uh, I've been playing vanilla Minecraft for over a year now, and I don't have any problems with it at all. It seems that just as it's starting to get maybe a little bit boring, they update it again and add more features so, so that you got more to play around with and, and there's no more boredom anymore. Yeah, this pickaxe isn't going to last. But I'll take out a few blocks with it, and let it pop, and then go make another one. And this might give me just enough stone bricks to make my house off to the side of the village. Yep, there we are. We gotta go make one. I think it's over this way. Yeah. So, we can, uh, let's make a couple of them, actually. Because we're going to need a couple. And as long as I keep sleeping when it gets dark, the villagers will be safe. It's when I start roaming around at night, uh, and I'm close, and the, the chunks that represent this village are loaded, now the villagers are not safe. And so, as long as I can keep the zombies from coming out and coming to get them, then they're going to be just fine. And while I'm doing all this fiddling around here, the gardens are growing, so by the time I'm done, I'll have fully grown gardens ready to harvest. Well, that's kind of convenient that it's uh, a lot of gravel under here. That'll be easier to replace with earth soil, that is, than uh, uh, it'll be easier to get it up than digging all of this stone. 
Oh, more charcoal or coal. Yay. We can always use a little bit more coal. That's a funny thing. When I'm caving, I don't usually leave coal behind. I might eventually leave coal behind, but the thing is, is that coal is so valuable. I mean, like, you need it for doing all of your cooking, uh, all of your smelting. You, you know, uh, you need it for torches. And when you're lighting up caves, you need a very large supply of torches, so you need a very large supply of coal. So, that's why you don't see me bypassing it when I see it. I, I go for it pretty well all the time. Oh, there's a cave nearby. I heard it by that funny sound. Okay, there's probably more underneath here. Nope. No there either. Okay. Okay, well I got lots of soil. Dirt, that is. Because this stuff down here isn't going to grow anything, so I'll call it dirt. And once I get to the top layer, it's soil now. <laughs> I know, I'm funny. I'm funny like that. Okay, now this top layer is soil now. Because it will grow the grass for me. There. One thing I don't have any of yet is string to make a bow. And the bow is so important for fighting off the skeletons. I cannot emphasize how important the bow is. Uh, especially since 1.5 came out. I'll admit that when, uh, when they uh, released 1.6, I think they tamed down the skeletons just a little bit. Because they don't seem to rapid fire you like they did before. And they do occasionally miss you now. But still, not that often, but occasionally. Oh, I guess I didn't need to take all that, but... Oh well. We'll just keep going. Keep going with it. Oh, we got lots of soil here. And we're going to have lots more when we're done, because there's a lot of land that needs to be leveled here. I want to... Oh, we got pretty well just enough time left, so I'm going to... Okay, just a little bit more digging here. Oh, and that's the end of my shovel, so I guess that's the end of my digging. Okay, so let's find a spot. Uh, I think I'm going to make myself a spot over here. Now, normally I would like to be building with, uh, like, uh, stone bricks. But right now, early in the game, I'm not going to get fancy like that. And I'll probably just use cobblestone. I don't know, over here looks better. This is a bigger, flatter spot. So let's you know, level this off. Oh, jeez, I didn't even think. I haven't got any glass. I don't have any glass, so let's go grab a few pieces of this sand. I don't know how many I need. Oh, there's a horse! Yay, I found a horse! Ha <laughs> He's even close by! Yay! Now all I gotta do is find a saddle for him. And I can tame him, and ride him, and hug him, and squeeze him, and just love him to pieces. And he's going to make me able to ride fast. One horse? That's it? Hey, well, I only need one. Uh, let's go up just a few more pieces here. I shouldn't have stopped so soon. Let's get a multiple of eight here. One more. There. Okay, so we got to go start cooking this glass. I've only got a few minutes left. Let's see if we can get this house built in that few minutes. And I'm getting hungry. And I guess I'm going to pick up this stuff and take it to my future location here. Um... Let's make a pick. Oh no, I don't need to make a pick. I need to make a shovel. 
that's what I really need. And let's pick up this stuff. Oh no, I can't pick up that chest because it's full of stuff. Uh-oh, it's dark already. Jeez. Okay, let's lay the bed down, I guess, and sleep. Because we're not going to be able to build at night with the villagers at risk. Okay, now we'll take the bed. We'll remember our chest is here full of stuff. And we'll go back to that spot we had over here. Just on the other side of this hill. We'll lay our bed down over here for now. And we'll get the furnace laid down here too. And we're going to put in the glass to be, or the, the uh, sand to be cooking into glass. And we'll get our crafting bench laid down as well. Okay, now we've got enough cobble here. So let's do uh, a somewhat standard building that I like to create here. Clear the area a bit. Okay, so generally what I'll do is I'll, uh, one, two, three, four, one, two, three, wait a second, we want one, two, three, door, one, two, three, yeah. What have we got here? Am I getting the spacing right? One, two, three, four, five. One, two, three, four, five. There. There, so we got our corners in place. And the first time I built this, I didn't do this this way, but then I did afterwards, right? So uh, bear with me. Oops. <laughs> And part of the reason I, I started doing it this way is because uh, in the beginning it didn't seem necessary and then eventually it did seem necessary. So that's why I do it this way now. I basically have a door opening on each side now. So no matter which way I want to go, I don't have to run around the house to do it. Yeah. And each corner is a window opening, so I can see out in every direction. And this is where I wish I had more wood, which I don't have. So let's go and chop some, actually, let's get another axe, because we're probably going to need it. Uh, lots of wood. Yeah, I don't, I'm probably not going to need two more axes, but we'll make them anyway. And it's too bad. We're getting so close to the end of the episode that I'm not going to be able to finish this. But you can see... Let's make the doors. I'm going to put the doors on it. One door. Two doors, three doors, four doors, is all the, we got enough glass here yet? We, we got enough to start it. I don't like using the glass panes, I'll, I'll use the full size blocks. I really should use the panes more because it conserves on your glass usage. But, hey, call me strange. <laughs> there. So this is what it'll be like inside. Nice and spacious. I can see in every direction where I want to go. I can exit where I want to instead of on one particular side. And um, 
Well, let's forget about the chopping for now. We'll use dirt and cobble for the ceiling for now. We'll get it done. Because I've only got like a minute left, and that's about all I need to do it if I do it with dirt and cobble. We'll get that last piece of glass, too. Okay, so we'll start and put the cobble in. We'll change this to wood and make a proper top to it in the future, but for now we're just going to have it like this. And this looks a little bit similar to villager buildings that I've built when I'm trying to make the village larger. But not quite. This might work out good um, if I got enough glass to do it. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, and I'm one piece short. Okay, well. Darn it, I wasted a piece. Jeez. Okay, well, let's go get uh, two more bits of sand here. And we're going to cook it quickly. And we'll get our bed and set that in there. We're going to get our crafting bench and set that in there. Ready to go in, yay. And I usually like to set my bed somewhere around the middle. That looks good. And I'll set the crafting bench into the floor. There. Hi. And this is done cooking, good. And let's pick this up and take it inside too. And let's get rid of this bad piece of glass and put the good in. Alright, so we're all set. Okay. And that's about it. So there you go. We've got our first little home set up here. It's not much, it's not that fancy, but it'll do the trick. We've got our village started in its conversion, and we're all secure and ready to rock. So, I hope you enjoyed watching. Thanks for coming by. Everybody take care, and until next time, this is Neofiz, signing out.